Our main event for the Ring of Honor World Television Championship, Brian Cage, 272 pounds, taking flight and crashing down on Samoa Joe on the outside. Insane athleticism by a guy that is built like a beast. Let's take a look at this. Right over the top rope, damn near landing on his feet and on Samoa Joe, obviously. We have two strong brutes, one who can take flight, one who would just not stay down. Big double bicep pose. Uh -oh. Big double bicep, but potentially a big mistake. There is a lot of animosity in this match. It's not just a title match. I mean, I know here in the home of Ring of Honor in Baltimore, this will be huge for Brian Cage if he could capture this victory here over Samoa Joe. But, oh, here comes Joe with these stinging shots. Yeah, the, 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 the pose. Oh, cost him, but that spin kick, man, it caught him. Oh, God. Oh, man. Heavy chop, Joe. Oh, Manhattan drop, and now Samoa Joe hits the ropes. Big Dickensian kick by Joe, and now sits out with a senton. Near leg hooked, and no, Brian Cage able to kick out. You know, I know we don't have weight divisions in AEW, but this is a heavy weight match. This is, these are super heavy weights, yeah. my man. If that's yeah. what's going on right about now. Prince Nana slightly concerned for sure for his man, the machine, Brian Cage. Samoa Joe sent Cage in the corner of the power slam. The cover, almost a win. Wow. That was close. Yeah, Joe's a little bit upset that he couldn't get the win there. Man, it's just a great match. It's been a great night like we talked about. I'm excited for Friday night as well, and it's going to be a great rampage. Talk about heavyweights, though. You talk about super heavyweights and heavyweights. How about the, one of the greatest heavyweights of all time, Iron Mike Tyson, yeah. joining you guys on Rampage, yeah. doing commentary throughout the whole show this Friday, live from Atlantic City. Absolutely. Me, ooh, Excalibur, JR, and Mike Tyson. That's going to be awesome. Mike throws a right out duck. He'll let JR and Cage headed up to the top. Brian Cage turning in midair, dropping the elbow. He's gonna do it. He's gonna get him. Oh. No. Man, that was so close. Joe almost did not kick out there. Samoa Joe in serious trouble. Taz, as we saw in picture in picture, Cage did a great job of grinding Joe down, of taking this match nearly to a halt. Yeah, he did. He wore Joe down for sure. I think that's the best way you put it right there, Excalibur. Now, can he get him up? Can Oh, Joe sat down on him. Yeah, that's going to be hard to get him up. I know he's strong, but these guys have, have pushed each other to the oh, limit. Well, that's the way to do it with a pump handle. Yeah. It's a tighter throw. Oh, God, he's oh, got him up. Damn, right on his face. Brian Cage, two, and oh, Samoa Joe at the last possible moment. You are not going to see many athletes anywhere in the world watch this pump handle and just inverts him right over and sits out. Man, you're not gonna see anybody do that to Joe. Especially this late in the match, Taz, yeah, when you've yeah. gone so far and you pushed each other, right? And Brian yeah, Cage right. went for the discus Larian Joe. Oh my oh, God. Oh no, Cage reverses. So strong, Cage. This is a big time, big guy matchup. Discus Lariat on target, Cage covers, no! I'm telling you from experience, those multiple kickouts when you're on bottom, as Joe is, that takes a lot out of you. That's why Joe can't follow up. It's exhausting. Yeah. And Taz, I think maybe the saving grace for Samoa Joe right there, Cage did not neutralize the legs. No, he didn't. And that might have been the, that might have been it if he did. Okay. But I'm telling you, Joe, it's hard for him to follow up right now, but Cage looks to be in fine fickle about ready to finish off Joe. Whoa, Joe escapes oh, once again. Maybe not. Cage tries a Joe reverse. Still oh, got him. Joe changed arms and now he's got Cage locked in. You're not getting that left, Brian. I don't no, think he's getting those grapes fines are in. No, he, 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 he tapped. He, he had tapped. to. He had to. Winner of this match and still Ring of Honor World Television Champion, Samoa Joe. That's how quickly you can change, guys, when you're in against Samoa Joe. That was it a was heavy a, battle. Sorry, heavy battle. Yeah, it was a tough win, but a great win hang for on, Samoa hang on, Joe. Hang on, hang on. Now the gates of agony, the other members of the embassy, that's Bishop Khan and Toa Leona hitting the ring. This has been their MO over the last few weeks. And Toa now, he wants a piece of Joe. Joe has been just through Fighting a brutal head. match so far. What the hell? Oh, uh oh, uh oh. Here comes the TNT champion. Yeah, half of Ward Joe. It's Wardlow. Wardlow and Samoa Joe. They have formed a dominant team, and now 
Here we see the embassy once again retreating when faced with the prospect of facing off with Wardlow. Yeah, the embassy definitely had bad intentions on their mind for Samoa Joe, and Wardlow saved the day for sure. Well, Wardlow, well, Wardlow definitely is. Wait, 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 wait! Oh God, wait, wait! It's Hobbs, powerhouse Hobbs. Damn, Hobbs! First on Rampage, and now here on Dynamite, powerhouse Hobbs targeting Wardlow. He's got that TNT Championship in hand. Take a look at Hobbs. My God, what is? athletic specimen. What a statement made by Powerhouse Hobbs here tonight to cap us off on Dynamite. And thank you for joining us here tonight.